I walk into my lab, I hear the humming of all of the vacuums and all of the machines that are running, some from experiments from the night before. I go you know, directly to my computer where I check to see the latest findings on the disease that I'm working on, on cancer. Uh, because I want to know what's going on every day. Science moves very quickly. I, uh, there's a little bit of time I spend doing that in the morning, and then I go to check my cells. And this is something as a biologist I've been doing ever since I started as a cancer biologist. I, I grow cells that I do experiments on, and every morning I go and I say hello to them, see how they're doing. Hopefully they're still alive if I, you know, if the experiment was to keep them alive or dead, if <laughs> the experiment was to, to see how I can kill cancer cells. But a lot of my morning is spent on taking care of the cells, doing experiments on these cells. And on the bench, I do work on uh, gene regulation in cancer. So a lot of that requires me to, to put genes into these cells. Before I can do that, I actually have to make these genes um, on the bench. So I spend a lot of time you know, doing solutions, making uh, contraptions like vacuums to, to work on my hypothesis and my experiment. So cells are quite small, and the only way I can see the cells is by looking through a microscope. So every morning, I, I spend a lot of time actually on the microscope, sometimes taking pictures of my cells. So there are microscopes that have cameras set on them, uh, and the cells that I look at are sometimes labeled with different colors, fluorescent colors, so that I can see if a gene that I wanted to introduce into the cell is there. So uh, a lot of times when I'm working with genes, I'll actually attach this gene to a light, a green or a red light, so that when the gene turns on, this light turns on. And these are put into the cells. So I spend a lot of time actually in the dark room taking pictures of cells to make sure that the genes I'm turning on or off are turned on or off. So yes, that's one of the things that I find really fun in the lab.